come with the general objectives that are relevant to the in a certain field and work on them. Number two, selection of learning experience. You see, let me ask you, is it learning experience in a number of kids? What do you mean by learning Hello? You won't get Is it learning experience in Zambu or what is it? So from your experiences, actually we are going to select some of them that are useful for this watch curriculum development. Kuna mtu hapa kuna experience ya kusoma kwa kesi kwa hiyo tukipeana mtu hapa nafasi ya kujieleza vile anasoma kila mtu kuna experience huko. Lakini kwa hizo experiences zote we are going to select a few. Not all of them are necessary, is it? Kuna zingine history za hapa we don't need them. So we are going to select the ones that actually are necessary for the development of the curriculum. <coughs> Number three, organization of learning experience. After selecting or coming up with this learning experience in this field or in the field of education, we now organize this particular word, experience, in a way that they are relevant to the curriculum development. So what's up? We come up with objectives number one. We set them. The general word, objectives. Remember it is a process. <coughs> Remember it is a word, a process. Come up with general objectives, number one. Number two, do what? Set what? <coughs> the experience. Do you set? Do you set or select? Yes. You select. Experiences are there. So you select the ones that are what? Relevant to the development of the curriculum. Number three, you organize the experiences that are now necessary for the de development of the watch curriculum. Then number four, you evaluate. You really selected them, you've organized them, you are now evaluating. Another name of evaluation means assessment. You now assess them that are very necessary, that will then work. Under the development of what? Of their 